Hey guys, welcome back. As you can see by the title of this video, I have a haul from Up the Creek scent. Absolutely love this vendor. Love her wax. Her name is Shannon. Um, Up the Creek scent is out of Michigan. So I placed an order on the 5th and today is October 15th. It came yesterday, the 14th or the 13th. I can't remember. But anyway, there's that. If your order is $55 or more, it's free shipping. Otherwise, I think the shipping is, uh, it's either seven or $8, I'm pretty sure. Um, so yeah, so I got mine just to the amount to get free shipping. She does send an invoice, doesn't have prices, but it just goes over, you know, what you ordered. And then it just said, thank you very much, Susan. I appreciate you. Um, smiley face and a heart, Shannon. So always appreciate the little personal touch of like a handwritten thank you. Um, and then also on the box, she does put a sticker that thanks you for supporting a small business. So... All right, so I got some samples. Let's do those first. The first one is in Christmas Past. And let me see what the shape is. Oh, it's cute. It's a little house. I don't have scent descriptions. But if you go to her website, her scent list is there. I think I did try to look this one up, though. This smells like Christmas trees and like a little like mentholated something and some cinnamon maybe. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. But it does smell good and very um, holiday-esque. So there's that. The next one is in Blueberry Pumpkin Patch, which I'm pretty sure I've had this from her before. And this is an acute sugar skull. Which is that? Oh, this is nice. Um, yeah, this is a nice, like pumpkin filling pumpkin. Maybe a tiny bit of spice with the blueberries. That's good. Yum yum. Then um, we have blueberry marshmallows. Cute. And that's in a little Christmas stocking. Adorable. Hmm. This blueberry definitely smells different than the other one. This smells very um excuse me, candied with the marshmallow. It's nice. Again, I'm not the biggest fan of blueberry. But there's that. Always, 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 always appreciate samples. And um, it just came in the uh, flat rate envelope. All right. I ordered Vermont Honey Apple. This is in her Sugar Skulls four pack. So these are these are four dollars. I don't know what the weights. I don't know what these are supposed to. Wait, I'm gonna bring my phone up to check. Oh, this is so good. So Vermont Honey Apple. This is a Bath and Body Works dupe. Oh, it's so yummy. Definitely get the pear in here with the apple. And I think this is supposed to be like peony. And, I don't know, maybe some kind of vanilla. But this is really delicious. Delicious. So, that will be a good one. Perfect for this time of year. Uh, pecan Waffle Marshmallow Fireside. Okay, again, in the sugar skull. I do not know what's going on with my iPad. Hopefully it fixes itself. Nope, it wants to stay out. Well, we'll see how long this lasts because I might have to stop and restart. 
I can't show you guys anything. See that? New no, doesn't want to work. There we go. Sorry. Like I said, I've had this looked at and I don't know what's up with it. So anyway, pecan waffle marshmallow fireside. It smells delicious. You do, I do get that fireside. Oh, that's good, you guys. Oh, this is sweet and smoky. Not very smoky, but this smells amazing. Yum, yum, yum. So like I said, $4 for these. And then I think all the rest that I have are her snap bars, which are also $4. Um, and I think that they're three, like over three ounces of wax. For some reason, that's what's sticking in my head. Oh, Okay, so this is Peppermint Marshmallow Serendipity Bread. Delicious. So you got that creamy marshmallow-ness mixed with the peppermint. It's delicious. Oh, this is so good. So good. And I feel like I've had this before. And I also want to say, I think my friend Amy, Amy, if you are watching this, is this one of your favorites that you love from her? I feel like something about like her serendipity bread, something. I could be totally way off. Um, but, and I think I've had this before and it does smell amazing. Any time of the year, peppermint for me. Pink lavender peppermint. Um, oh gosh, this is good too. You get the pink sugar, you get the lavender. Oh, and that delicious peppermint. This is really yummy. And I know a lot of vendors do a pink sugar, lavender. I get that. I know. But I love it. Really, really good. Her stuff performs really fantastic um, in my house. I've never had any issues. You know, maybe some sense light. But I've never had something that didn't perform. I don't, that I can recall. So, I mean, I just continue to order from her. <sighs> okay, sorry. This is glazed lemon cookies. I'm, like, already opening and sniffing and doing the things and not showing. Oh, God. This is good. Um, so, bakery-esque because of the cookies. But the lemon on cold to my nose, does it does come across a little... A little bit like cleaner lemon, not a lot. That's just what my nose is picking up on cold right now. Um, but pumpkin apples. So my oldest son smelled this and thought that it smelled really, really good. And yes, I know they came a little broken. I don't really care. I have to break them to use them anyway. Um, anyway, my oldest son smelled this one and thought that it smelled delicious. He smelled it and I said, what do you think it smells like? And he first said apple cider donuts. And I told him it was pumpkin and apples. Oh, this is good. This definitely has some spice, but it's very, I don't know, spi like the full spicy, which is very appropriate. So there's that. And there goes my iPad again. Oh. This is pecan waffle, marshmallow, fireside, and leaves, which this is pecan waffle marshmallow fireside so this has the le the addition of the leaves so i'm gonna just smell them side by side and see if i smell a difference Yep. So you do. I, I can detect the leaves in here. And this, I think, is the only one that didn't come <laughs> cracked a little bit. Isn't that weird? Anyway, it smells really good. I love her little, um, her labels, too. And they do have the website um, on there. Her stuff does not have poor dates, but... 
um, because this was like ready to ship. As far as I'm concerned, this is ready to go. All right, this next one is strawberry shortcake and vanilla ice cream. I wanted to try her strawberry shortcake. Yeah, no, I don't like this one. Nope, not on cold anyway. It's very green. It's very vine heavy. I was expecting like sweet dessert, strawberry shortcake. And I, the vanilla ice cream's giving it a little, it's a little sour. Sorry, my stomach's growling too. Um, so not crazy about this one on cold. Who knows, it could be um, a fave when I warm it, but not loving that one on cold. Can't love everything. Raspberry confetti cake. I love, love, love raspberry. Not all raspberry is created equally. Ooh, this is yummy. This is very yummy. This is almost like a like sugary raspberry um, icing to my nose. It's sweet and a tiny little bit body care like. This would make a very pretty um, body spray. <laughs> Raspberry confetti cake. I like this. I like this one a lot. This will be nice to warm on a day that you need a break from some heavy bakery. Um, is everybody in full swing of melting fall stuff? Is anybody tired of it yet? Ooh. This is key lime pink sugar, and I'm 99% sure that I've had key lime from her before, and I really enjoyed it. This is nice with pink sugar. Um, sweetness in there with the key lime, which can be tart, but I wouldn't say that my nose specifically knows, knows that that's pink sugar, and that label's adorable with the key lime pie right there. Um, so that smells really good too. Only a couple more. This is Mac Apple Sugar Cookies. Love, love, love Apple. This is good. Yep. Just a nice, strong Mac Apple. Um, I'm not, do I smell sugar cookies? Not right the second, I don't. But really good. Very good. Apple. Deep fried apples. Because why not? Ooh. Okay, so this doesn't smell fried like, I know this is weird, but some of those like the concession like concession stand scents. They smell greasy to me. This doesn't have this, but this apple smells the green apple tart. It's yummy. It's very yummy. It's reminding me of um, a little tiny bit. You know that the candy now and laters? I don't even know if they make those anymore, but they had an apple. I think it was apple. Yeah, I want to say the label was green for it, of the now and laters. Anyway, that's what this is reminding me of. It just had a little flashback of that. So there's that. Two left. I have whipped cream topped eggnog. Oh, this is so good. Again, not all eggnogs are created equal. This smells like a, you poured yourself an ice cold glass of eggnog and the non-alcoholic eggnog. No booze added to this one with maybe a little bit of like cinnamon on top. Sweet and yummy. This is really good. Um, we just have to have a little bit of eggnog. Um, scents for around Christmas. And then this is Cotton Candy Rainbow Sherbet. 
I feel like I've had her cotton candy. And I've had her sherbet. Just not, just not together. Oh, this is yummy. Tart and sweet and almost cold. I know, does cold have a smell? But yes. Oh, we could just took sherbet out of the freezer. Get a little bit of the orange. Some lime. I think a hint of like lemon in there. This is yummy. This is definitely making my mouth water. This smells really, really good. Delish. Delish, delish. So, there it is. My order from Up the Creek Scents. Love this vendor. I've never had any issue. Her stuff is easy to order from um, her website. I do believe that she is on vacation, but you can still place an order. It just won't ship until she's back. Um, I've ordered in the past, gosh, it's been a couple of years, I want to say. She had a really cute, um, like, Christmas movie sampler. Um, and it was fantastic. Stuff did really, really well. Really everything that I've had from her. Um, I've had this sitting here from an order from a while, a long time ago. It's strawberry raspberry guava from her. And I love it so much. I bought many of these. Oh, and this is the last one I have. And I brought it up because um, I'm like craving it and I think I'm going to warm it in my bedroom warmers. So that's it, you guys. That's everything that I have from Up the Creek Scents. Um, I hope you are all doing well, having a great weekend. We've had a stormy day here, which has been very, very nice. It stopped for a few hours. The sun came out. Now it has gotten very dark again and it is thundering and lightning. So... That's it. I hope you guys are well, having a wonderful weekend. I'll be back with uh, my empties. Take care. Talk to you guys later.